We are all sharing in this day today, this moment of life, because life is comprised of moments. Khalil Gibran said in The Prophet, in the sweetness of friendship, let there be laughter. I see in front of me two friends. From the moment that I met you, and actually before we ever actually met, I was just eyeing you from across the office. Before we'd ever spoken any words to each other, I admired you. Ever since you've come into my life, I've been amazed by you, by your wit, by your intelligence, by your empathy maybe most importantly, your ability to put up with me. When I met you, I, I had tunnel vision. All that mattered was the next case. I was alive, but I, I wasn't living. You changed that. You changed me. You changed everything. Anywhere you go, you bring the brightness, the smile, the laugh, the energy into any room that you're in. And yet somehow, since I've known you, you always make me feel like I am the only one in the room there with you. I promise to always be the one to build you up like you did for me the first time we ever met. I promise to challenge you to be the best version of yourself always. I promise to make you laugh when you're taking life too seriously. Looking at you here today, I am absolutely certain that you are the best thing that's ever happened to me. You gave me the gift of purpose, of direction, of hope. I know that you'll be there for me, for our family, for our children, for our pugs. I am so grateful that you chose me to spend the rest of your life with. And I want to let it be known here and now in front of everybody that I vow to continue to be grateful, to continue to cherish you, to protect you, to stand by your side and love you until the end of my days. And I promise that I will always make you try new foods, <laughs> even though you absolutely hate to do that. But I also promise that I will always make homemade pasta sauce afterwards. <laughs> I promise that as long as we live, we will have a house full of pugs. And most importantly, I promise that I will always love you the most. And I now pronounce James and Caitlin husband and wife. You may kiss your bride.